Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan. In this very exciting and powerful video of system of exponentials, where we are having two equations x power x power 10 equal to 10 and y power y power 100 equal to 100. We have to find the expression x y power 50. So we will use the exponent, we will use the properties of exponent, but see what I am writing. This is 1 million question. Why it is 1 million question? We will talk little later. It is not 1 million dollar or 1 billion question. So it is 1 million. We will talk little later. Let us write this is equation 1 and this is equation 2. If you will observe the given equations, so they are identical except values. The right hand side and its exponent value is changing. See 10, 10 and 100, 100. So we will solve for first one first, then we will talk about second. So what I am going to do, I will write equation first x power x power 10 equal to 10. Now we will solve this question by substitution. What I will substitute? x power 10 as a. Let me consider a. So let me write here x power 10 equal to a. So by exponent property, I will write both sides, it's power 1 over 10. First we will write the power 1 over 10. Now I will use the exponent property that is a power b whole power c that is equal to a power b c and if required then c power b with the same bracket. Bracket is important. Maybe somewhere here and there it was little more means this form is called general form a par b par c this is general form and if it is nothing written that means we can consider a par b c a par b par c that is a par b par c in this manner now we cannot take c and b product so these are few important properties of exponentiation it is not property of exponential only. It will be useful once you raise its power higher. Okay, come to our original equation that is x power 10 power 1 over 10. So I will use that property. I will write left hand side as x power 1. That means x. So x is equal to a power 1 over 10. This is our ultimate result. Now what I am going to do, I will substitute this value of x here. Power is a. So power will be as it is x part 10, we will substitute a. From there we calculated base x, this base. Exponent that is fix a. So I will write this as a raised to the power 1 over 10 whole power a equal to 10. Okay. Now, by the same property, a power, this property I am talking about, this is very, very useful exponent property. I will take the product of exponent. So, it will become a power a over 10, I can write, or I can swap the power also. I can write in place of 1 over 10, I can write a, in place of a, I will write 1, 1 over 10. So, now it is a power 1 over 10, raise both sides, 10th power. So a power a over 10 whole power 10 equal to 10 power 10. Okay. Now again I will use the same property a power b power c a power b c. So that will give us a power a equal to 10 power 10. So just by observing both sides base identical exponent is also identical. We will directly write after comparing both sides a equal to 10. But what was a? a was our substitution. a variable introduced by us only. So what I will find out x. What is x? x power 10 is equal to a. So let me write here x power 10 equal to a. Raise both sides 1 tenth power. So x power 10 whole power 1 over 10 equal to a power 1 over 10. 
So now this time we will cancel by the same exponent rule. X will come out a raised to the power 1 over 10. Put the value of a there. So x will be equal to 10 raised to the power 1 over 10. Okay. Or 10th root of 10. You can also write in this manner. Remember, it is 1 million question. We will talk about this little later. Now, second equation. Y power y power 100 equal to 100. So, similar pattern. You will substitute y power 100 equal to b. Similarly, you will solve what result you will get. In place of 10, it is 100 only. So, I will write 100 power 1 over 100. Is that okay? So, you will get y as 100 power 1 over 100. Now, we have to find out this expression xy power 50. Let's find out. So, let me write from this first equation x is coming out 10 raised to the power 1 over 10. And from second equation, we have got 100 raised to the power 1 over 100. Now we have to find out xy power 50. Let me write here xy power 50. Let's put the value of x and y. So x is 10 raised to the power 1 over 10. And y is 100 raised to the power 1 over 100. Whole power is 50. You can see base is 10 here, base is 100A. So I will convert 100 base into 10. So how I can write 100 is equal to 10 is square and then I will use A power B power C. Same property I will write A power B C. So let me write here 10 power 1 over 10 times 10 power 2 1 over 100 power is 50. 10 power 1 over 10. Second term will be using the same exponential property. 10 raised to the power 1 over 50. Whole power is 50. Now, A times B, this is exponent property, whole power X. Then we can write as a power x times b power x. That common exponent can be distributed among the products. Product. It is multiplication a dot b. So I will take the same property here. 10 raised to the power 1 over 10 times 50. Okay. And 10 power 1 over 50 times 50. So that will come out. 10 raised to the power 5 times 10 raised to the power 1, which is a raised to the power x times a raised to the power y. Then we can write a raised to the power x plus y. So 10 raised to the power 6. And what is the value of 10 raised to the power 6? This is 1 million. Now you will be laughing that why it is called 1 million question because our answer is 1 million thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe like share thanks a lot we will meet tomorrow same time